Illiteracy among adults is really a silent epidemic. And it is an epidemic that remains silent because unlike obesity or diabetes or cancer or other epidemics that we're familiar with, there's nobody studying and tracking adult illiteracy. There's an enormous investment in tracking test scores and academic performance of young children. But as soon as people have gone through the education system, they've turned 21, they've succeeded in high school or they haven't, that's it. We forget about them. We don't track it anymore. I believe that the literacy crisis should definitely be on the national agenda. It should be also on New York's agenda. And frankly, I don't see that. Bronx is blessed with many great libraries, but there's something where the larger culture has really withdrawn literacy from these communities, withdrawn text and print, and alienated people from a culture, excluded them from a culture that still is the dominant culture. So much creativity is necessary to survive, and through that just brings this great, beautiful, vibrant culture. Four and a half years is a long time. How do you graduate from high school not being able to read? Thousands of people in New York have graduated from high school over the years not being able to read. 